Alright guys, so this is the leg workout. If you're feeling like you need to put up your game or you need to switch it up a bit, try this out. Let me know how it goes. Alright, enjoy. Check me out. I'm in the treadmill. 30 minutes. Walk. That's it. What's going on guys? Back here with the commentary. Alright, here. So here I did some calf stretching. For both legs, alright, you gotta stretch your calf because I just walked for half an hour on the treadmill. I, I think I jogged even a little. So I felt a bit of tightness in my calves. So I did a bit of stretch. This is a really good way of stretching. You can do it anywhere, anytime to stretch your calf muscles. Fact, your calf is your second heart, alright. It pumps the blood back from your lower part of the body back to the top, alright. Now here a bit a bit of a spine stretching. Alright, I didn't do I didn't really put in the full stretch because the video then will be very long. So I just put in some important ones. Here I did some again. You got to stretch your glutes, you got to stretch your hamstring because you're gonna do squats. When you're gonna do heavy squats, you're going to need to stretch your muscles first. Alright, now here I'll do front squats. So in front squats, you gotta make sure that your form is right you can't screw up your form you screw up your form you screw up your back you got to make sure that your back is tight all right your glutes are tight your ankle flexibility is right there now i'm using futsal shoes so futsal shoes has a flat base it's not really the most optimum way of doing of using those shoes with squats but that's all i have and that's all i have to do with all right if i'm gonna buy some squat shoes it's gonna be damn expensive and i don't have the right money right now so here I did about uh, 10 to 12 reps of just warm up, alright, just warm up just to get the form in right and then uh, later on I'm going to show you guys my last set. Alright, now here this, no no this is not my last set, this is actually my beginning set, alright, uh, each side is 15 kilos, so 30, 30 kilos total. Now I wore my knee sleeves because I felt like my knees were a bit loose so I wore my knee sleeves to give it a bit of more support it's just a psychological thing all right I wore I wear my knee sleeves if I feel like there's something wrong and it actually keeps your knee uh, really hot and firm so that your mobility is higher right now in here in here all right the same thing you gotta make sure that your form is right all right once your form is right, then everything else will just go into play alright uh, and also in this video guys I think this video will be posted on uh, Friday alright so on Friday then on I won't be posting any videos on Saturday and on Saturday maybe even Sunday maybe on Monday I might post my vlog alright and then uh, yeah so be sure on a lookout alright now guys back to the workout this is my last set my last set i did this is uh 80 kilos for six and believe it or not this was my pr and i did it for six sets so i could have shot for a new pr but then i didn't want to burn all out on my squats i need to do and this is just the beginning of my workout again keep your form tight go all the way down go all the way up all right i wore i even wore a safety belt for this a lumbar brace or you want to call it a weightlifting belt whatever you want to call it just make sure that it's not so tight until you can't breathe and it's not too loose until you don't feel the flexion all right now done with the front squats now we are going into sumo deadlifts all right sumo deadlifts is a very very good workout for your glutes i didn't really knew the full function of sumo deadlifts all right i'm not really a big fan of sumo deadlifts i'm still getting used to it all right this is actually my last uh my my third working set not my last set this is my third working set I did uh, I did lifted 80 kilos all right so in here I yes I still use my my weightlifting belt all right because I felt like my back was a bit tight I needed to support it a bit so I did this for I think for six reps all right I kept every exercise I kept the rep ranges around uh, six to 12 reps all right then after this sumo deadlifts I did leg presses now leg presses okay this is my beginning set I did six plates on each side then I progressively went on each uh, plate higher and higher keep in mind this gym the heaviest weight they have is actually just 15 kilos so you gotta make do what you have now in this leg press you do eight sets of 
your leg, your feet being shoulder width apart and then later on now you move out to the outside of the of the bar and then you press another eight so it's a total of 16 per set all right feet close together for eight and then feet wide apart for eight now that now when your feet are close together it's going to work the outer part of your thighs when your feet are wider because it's going to work your inner part of your thighs so two in one beauty all right two in one beauty now after this um i did yes leg extensions so for leg extensions i felt like my right quads had a bit of lesser mass so what nowadays i can do is i change my leg extensions a bit i do individual style all right once i'm done with one side then i move on a bit then i do the other side so it gives both sides same amount of pressure i feel like this gives more concentration to both my my quadriceps all right so it makes the growth a bit more equal all right it depends on you either way now hamstring curls so hamstring curls same thing again like you gotta stretch your hamstrings all right you don't do half reps don't do jerking reps it's not gonna work you gotta stretch go all the way down go all the way up control the weight all right now once you're done with hamstring curls and then you gotta move on to here right here calf raises i'm so sorry the camera angle is not that right yet but what i did was first of all you gotta make your feet shoulder width apart all right now your feet are gonna just face straight ahead then after that your face will go fit your feet will face outwards and then on your third set your feet will face inwards all right so it's like a v and then it's like a w so this is gonna work all three hits of your calves and then here it's just me fooling around and flexing <laughs> Alright guys, so that's the end of the workout. I hope you enjoyed it. The full workout is in the link in the description and also on my promo codes and affiliations and whatever. My email, my Twitter, everything is in the link in the description. Every time it's just there. I don't know whether you guys know it or not. You can check out everything, whatever information is in the link in the description. Alright, have a good day. I'll see you next time.